the University of Toledo, a uh, nursing class of 2010, and we're going to explain diuretics. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and start with the thiazide-like diuretics. Um, examples are in the pindamide and uh, metazolazone, something like that, alright? Um, indications, uh, management of mild to moderate hypertension and uh, treatment of edema associated with CHF. Uh, the MOA, um, also known as the mechanism of action, is to increase the uh, secretion or excretion um, of sodium and water, and it's done by inhibiting the uh, NA reabsorption um, in the distal tubule. And um, as we stated on our poster, it's a different part of the distal tubule than it is associated with the thiazide diuretics. Um, Side effects of thiazide-like diuretics include uh, hypotension, dizziness, drowsiness, nausea and vomiting, and uh, hypokalemia. Hypokalemia meaning um, decrease in uh, potassium. Uh, nursing implications that we found that were important with thiazide-like diuretics include monitoring of uh, BP, uh, including um, looking for the hypotension that we talked about with the side effect, uh, side effects, uh, edema we need to check for, and electrolyte levels, especially the potassium. And that'll be it for that. Okay, next we have got um, loop, loop diuretics. And that um, some examples of loop diuretics are furosemide, furosemide, and butanide. <laughs> um, indications for these are um, management of hypertension and treatment of edema due to congestive heart failure. Um, the mechanism of action for loop diuretics is um, they inhibit the reabsorption of sodium and chloride from the loop of Henle in the distal renal tubule. And um, some side effects of these medications are dehydration, hypertension, dizziness, nausea and vomiting, and hypokalemia, because they're not potassium sparing. Um, nursing interventions for this are, um, you really need to monitor blood pressure, edema, electrolyte levels, especially potassium, and I know. Next, we're going to talk about the thiazide diuretics, and some examples, as you can see on the board, are chlorothiazide and hydrochlorothiazide. And as you can see, the indications to know that these are thiazide diuretics are the end and the thiazide. So some indications for this um, are the management of mild and moderate hypertension, treatment of edema, and